Let's give you another go, girl. Hey, Milton, can you give me a hand with this fence? Sure. Know much about fence building? Not really. <laughs> can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers single-handed. Guess we all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. What was you doing before you came here? I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. We was in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. Well, sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. I was raised to take a man at his word, and also to believe this is a free country. So free that I can't tell you what to think. So I guess it don't much matter what you believe. But I will work hard, and I learn fast. Okay. Give me a hand with this fence. Yep, there's plenty more to do. Pound it in there, we don't want it coming down. Good, now grab a rail, line it up with a notch, and place it in. Any notch will do. Now, lift up the other side, they gotta line up, see? Now the next rail. Doing all right. Fine. Okay. That looks okay. Go to the next post and pound that in. I hope you've grasped the basics. I got other matters to attend to, but. There's more than a day's work here for you. All right. So long. I'll be counting sections when you're done. Okay. Give us a hand. Know much about bulls, Milton? Uh, just the basics. Don't make them mad. Angus Geddes, this is Jim I know Milton. how it feels. Mr. Milton? Angus Come is on. your boss's son. Nice to meet you. Well, let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. Come on! Move! Oh. 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 Shit! I'll get him. Get him right now. I gotta build that. Stop. No, you don't. Oh. Don't 
Now where are you going? Oh, come on. Oh, stop! Crap. Like you're gonna wind down, <laughs> but I'll try. Come on, Fed. Whoa there. Whoa there. Easy, easy. It ain't so bad. Nice and easy now, boy. There, there. There, there. Ease up. All better? Okay. <laughs> now come on, you hunk of Chuck. This way. Got him, Mr. Dickens. Oh, good. How you doing, son? A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. <laughs> good. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. your mouth, boy. You will be the first one we kill. Leave him alone. <laughs> oh, careful, boys. Careful. Yeah. Look at this tough guy. Get out of here. How oh, fancy parents get is paying you to be tough for him, huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, he's paying me to keep the place clean. Oh. Said he had some problems with vermin. Oh, listen to this. Real funny. <laughs> no! Oh, oh, come on, get him. Come on, get him. Oh, kick his head in, boss. <laughs> Mr. Milton. <laughs> oh, heck. When was the last time you had a bath? Oh, he's licking you, boss. It's like that, huh? Oh, oh, you need help? You couldn't clean my boots. That boy can punch. Jim Milton, get off that man! Get off! He hit me first. Oh, you can fight, boy. I'll give you that. Well, how's your wife in a brawl? Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here. Oh, quite a temper you got. <laughs> Imagine you're you're frustrated with your lot in life. Married to a shit shoveling farmhand. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you both. We'll see you again. And you, boy. Tell Mr. Geddes we called. We'll be back. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Milton. Thank you. Don't worry about it. You stop acting like a goddamn storybook hero, will ya? What choice did I have? Plenty, you moron. Plenty. We all get caught eventually, John. I guess the trick is to decide by who. Now, dear, I, I won't hear any more. Good. You won't hear any of it. Not in front of the men. You toad. All right, smile. Do not embarrass me. I 
you getting on? Surviving. I think. Here. I'll get you some coffee. Only thing I know how to do is... Well, no. Undertakers like me. Cattle? Not so much. That ain't true. I ain't no rancher. Rustled horses, not raised them. Stole cattle, not birthed them. I was... I was reading the newspaper. I was reading about a old ranch, Beecher's Hope, down by Blackwater. Was you? Well, Jack read it to me, but I thought maybe we could raise some money. Bank could lend us the rest. We could be happy, John. We Bank could... loans? I got a goddamn price on my head, woman. I know. I know all about that. Every time we about to get somewhere, make something, you go and show the entire world that you ain't Jimmy Milton. Every place we've been, it's been the same. We start doing okay, and then boom. You act like the big man with the gun. I'm tired, John, and I guess I was dreaming a little. At least give me that. Just feels hopeless. You're doing better. Milton! Milton, ma'am. Mr. Geddes needs you to head over to Strawberry in the wagon and collect some mail for him at the post office. Sure. I'll take the boy with me. He's getting soft. Lance a lot. Come on. Jim, if you're heading that way, can you pick up a parcel for me? A dress I ordered. I think it's in your name? My name. I think so. One's in your name and the other one's in mine. O only one should have come in by now. How much shopping you done? Oh, yes. A real keen purchaser of goods, me. Look at me. <laughs> Okay, Lancelot. We'll make a man out of you yet. Not too much of a man, mine. He's only a boy. I'm just gonna show him how to drive the wagon a little. We'll save the real exciting realities of adulthood for another day. Come on, get! You take care now. Of course. It's nice getting out of the house, huh? I like being in the house, Pa. Life ain't just about doing things you like, boy. Yes, sir. You make that clear enough. What's that supposed to mean? Only that you aren't so happy here with us. Son, I'm happy. It's just... I, I find it hard, is all. You'll understand someday. Here. Want to take the reins a little? I, I don't know, Pa. Uh, it's easy, boy. Don't be scared. Well, uh, w what do I do? Well, just hold them and pull them short to slow down. Tell them to go faster. Give them a little switch. And then pull to one side if you want to turn. Here, try it out. I've seen you without a book in your hand. It was foolish to forget mine, sir. Look, I got some business to attend to with the clerk. I'll leave you with the wagon. Can I trust you not to drive off with it? Oh, I think I can be trusted to that. We ever gonna get to Strawberry going like this? Very good. I have a feeling that Phil will prove more profitable than theater production. All right, here we are. You all right, son? Sure. Well, cheer up a little. You wait here. I won't be long. Okay. And if you behave, I might let you drive us home. Can't wait.
Hi. I'm here to... Name? M my name? Uh, Jim Milton. Jim Milton. Hmm. <laughs> nope. Nothing here. Uh, maybe try... Marston. John Marston. It's a long story. Okay. John Marston. Marston... Nope. Nothing here for that name, either. Try Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. Hmm. Yes, here we are. And also, I'm here to pick up the deliveries for Pronghorn Ranch. David Getty sent me. Pronghorn? Yes, er, uh, oh, er, uh, sign here. We have a bunch of stuff for you. <sighs> and I will help you out. <clears throat> I'll take these. You get the rest of the stuff. Here, let me help you with this, Mr. Marston. Uh, it's, uh, mostly Milton these days. It's a long story. Whatever you say, Mr. Milton. It's not important. Take care now. Give my regards to Gettys. Thank you very much, mister. Okay. Let's get out of here. Everything okay, Pop? Sure. I hope so, at least. Here. You take the reins a little. I ain't sure. Come on, son. You'll enjoy it if you try a little harder. Okay. Okay, Pa. Yeah. We're going back to Pronghorn, okay? So, wait. We've come all the way out here, and we just gonna turn around and go back? That's what we're doing. Turns out, uh, I missed the seclusion of the ranch more than I figured for. Don't you want to go to the store, or the saloon, or anywhere? We're going back. Okay, boy? But... I've been sitting in this wagon I don't know how long. But nothing. Keep on driving, and watch the road. Yes, sir. Thank you. Jesus. Mind your father, okay? I got my reasons, even if I don't care to explain them. Yes, sir. Better. Get up! Look, if I tell you to speed up, speed up. If I say slow down, you slow down, okay? Uh, sure. All right, speed up. Let's get away from there. Okay. Gee up! Sorry, sir. Was that a question for me? No. No, keep driving. Let's speed this up. Pick up the pace a bit. Just a bit faster now. I think we're going too fast, Pa. Fine. Pull your reins in. Around. Oh, Pa, hey. those men, are they following us? Just, just stay calm. See that fallen tree? When we get there, stop the wagon, jump down, and hide. Oh, Pa. You need to do exactly as I say, boy. Here, now! Uh, come on, 
Quick, now! Okay, son, you wait here. You don't move or say nothing until I speak to you. You hear? Yes, sir. Head down. Okay, gentlemen, let's see what you come calling about. What do you boys want with us? Oh, we just want to have a friendly chat. Are you John Marson? You sure look like him. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just here with my son. Did you kill a fella out in Roanoke a few months back? No. Wasn't me. That was my brother. I'm real sorry, friend, but he was trying to rob. You're talking bullshit, mister. Kill him. <laughs> Eyes closed. Let's go. Come on, get up. Why are you going so slow? Whoa, easy. Oh dear, those men. I told you not to look, boy. Are they dead? I didn't have much of a choice. You saw that. Now compose yourself. You killed them, Paul. Son. I need you to hold it together. You were real brave back there. Real brave. Did exactly like I said. Really? Uh huh. If you hadn't listened, things could have gone real wrong for us. An, uh, eventful trip. Go well, say hi to your mother. It's... I don't... We got shot at. Shot at? What happened? Well, we got followed, and then... We... Followed by who? Uh, probably someone who knew me. If we didn't get to them particulars, I'm sorry. My son. 
our son! It was your dress that caused all the problems. It weren't even a dress. It was a gift for you. Look, just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once. That's all I'm saying. hear any of it not in front of the men you toad all right smile smile do not embarrass me mr gettys hey i heard we had another incident with the uh, laramie boys yeah there was an incident well, i mean to scare me are you scared a little i've got a lot invested in this place and, and not just the land but but my family it's uh it's hard to explain I understand. I'll do my best to keep you safe, sir. Yeah, I know you will. So how's your family? Uh, just fine. I should probably head back. <laughs> yeah, I know how it is. <laughs> How'd you get on? Okay, I guess. Better? Sure, I'm just tired. I know. Anybody want some more? Uh, no, no, I'm thank good. You. I miss Mr. Pearson. John Marston, you're such a pig. <laughs> 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 All right, it's getting late. Let's get some rest. Good night, Jack. Good night, Mama. Good night, Jack. Good night, Pa. What the hell was that? What are you, what are you doing? My job, Abigail. Lock this door behind me. Don't open it unless you know it's me. So, Jim, you gotta do something. Two of them found a soul. They got tongues. It's a rich man. Who's it? <laughs> Who's this? New hand? You're that tough guy they just took. Jim? You know that offer? It just was. They've killed Mr. Tobert! And they've stolen my goddamn cattle! You men okay? I think so. Yeah. Jim Milton saved my life. It's Mr. Abel. Yeah, of course, it's Mr. Abel. I can't believe he thinks he can scare me out of here. Then I guess we're getting your cattle back, I guess sir. we are. Can you go too, Tom? Of course, sir. All right, Jim, I know you can handle yourself. A little. Go get your guns and head out. Guns? Oh, don't play coy with me, son. We need your help. I don't care what you used to do or what your, your, your name is. This is the land of second chances. Understood. Okay. Come in, it's me! What was it? Mr. Getty's cattle was taken. God, I'm sorry to hear that. What are you doing in that thing? Mr. Getty's been real good to us. We, I. What are you doing? My job, Abigail. My goddamn job. I'll lead the way. This is gonna be the last we hear out of them. Yeah, yeah, right. 